Alright guys, Hardcore Hector here, back with more of the Johto Gym Leader Castle in Pokemon Stadium 2. I'm gonna be taking on Team Rocket. I really don't remember this part of the whole Gym Leader Castle. I'm pretty sure I def or completed Pokemon Stadium 2 before though. I don't know. So which team am I gonna choose? Probably go with Mew, because they probably have poison type Pokemon and everything. But um, this probably was around the time in Gold, Silver, Crystal, Heart Gold, Soul, Silver, when... Actually, I think it's supposed to be... Well, it's before and after the next gym battle, actually. Hold on, let me choose some Pokemon first. Um, yeah, going with Mew and probably Doug Trio. And Big Danny or... Let's go with Phoenixor. <coughs> So before and after the next gym is when you did face Team Rocket on the actual RPG game. You do it at Lake of Rage, and then you do the gym leader battle, gym battle, whatever, and then you go to Goldenrod City, Radio Tower, and take them on even more. So you fight Team Rocket quite a bit around this time, so I guess they decided to put it in the gym leader castle, which I think is kind of lame, but whatever. Ice Beam. I'm gonna switch out. Yep. Doggone it, it's not working. And wheezing. Well, that's not a very good choice or, you know, switch a route. You know what I'm talking about, supplement. I'm still gonna knock your ass out psychic. So that's all I'm saying, man. That's all I'm saying. Oh, that was wrong one. That was Fire Blast. Damn it. I'm used to psychic being top. Damn it. I thought he was going to self-destruct or something. I should survive this. Yep. Alright, Psychic. Now knock him out. But yeah, in th that part of the game, with all this, that Team Rocket stuff, kind of dragged on, in my opinion. Especially since they don't really vary the team are the teams of the Team Rocket people, the Grunts. And I think also in Generation 2 is when they started calling each person like a Team Rocket Grunt and stuff. In Generation 1, they were just called Rockets. It's like Rocket wants to fight, or something like that. But yeah, you fought all those Rockets up on the Lake of Rage, and then, well, there weren't too many at the Lake of Rage, but then you go to the Team Rocket headquarters in Mahogany, and then after you defeat the Gym Leader, then you have to go back to Goldenrod, you go through so many floors of Team Rocket people, then you have to go underground and defeat even more rockets there, and then you clear out, finish clearing out the radio tower of more rockets. So yeah, I think they slow down the story way too much there. Then Gold, Silver, and Crystal is just Team Rocket grunts and stuff like that, trying to resurrect Team Rocket. And in Gold, Heart Gold and Soul Silver, that's when they started um, adding like Team Rocket admins or something like that. Oh damn it! I think they got it from um, Diamond, Pearl, Pearl, and Platinum because that team, what was it, Team Galactic? I believe they actually had admins and stuff like that. Well, actually, um, Ruby Sapphire and Emerald didn't they have admins too? Like um. Well, I know that they had leaders of each one. I think they didn't have admins until later on. I don't remember. We'll have to see once we go through it. Earthquake. <laughs> what? Wow, that was lucky. Just how I planned it. You plan that to miss? One Pokemon remains. The Pokemon emerges from its Pokeball. Is this his last one or the second one? Actually, right, so the first? No, it's this last one. Okay. So, yeah. This battle is almost over, but we have freaking four battles for freaking Team Rocket, man. Even here, they have to make it long and boring. Because the other ones, it went like two, three, 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 two, one, and then four. Come on, man. Nobody wants to fight Team Rocket that much. Well, there's supposed to be a game, but come on. Hang on, earthquake. Right, that's a hit. 
And then the rival... I don't think... I don't know if the whole lore of the rival was laid out in Gold, Silver, and Crystal. But then by Fire Red and Leaf Green, and then Heart Gold and Soul Silver, we pretty much knew that your rival in Gold, Silver, and Crystal was the son of Giovanni, who was the leader of Team Rocket. But then in Gold, Silver, and Crystal, he was trying to defeat Team Rocket. But then again, it wasn't it wasn't really his father's Team Rocket because um, his father disbanded Team Rocket and then Team Rocket was just trying to auto-revive, or well, not auto-revive, you know, bring itself back without Giovanni. And then they were trying to get Giovanni to come back to see how strong they were or something, but he never came back. And so maybe that's why he was, the rival was trying to take him out. Trying to take out Team Rocket, I, I don't know. Still just a lot of speculation. Hmm. I guess I'll go with that. Another rocket grunt wants to battle. How will the challenger respond to this unexpected threat? Gun is this Drows. Draws Nas. Draws number one. Pin missile. Let's see how well this Get does. All five times and took out off about half of his HP. Oh, but he's got toxic, man. Damn it. This elephant snout. Right, let's see how well Thunderbolt goes. Aw, oh, Protect, come on. He's gonna make this, or she I think it was, is gonna make this battle drag on. Still didn't knock him out. Dang it. And then there's Mount Mortar in between, or uh, right before Mount or uh, Mahogany Town, which is where the next gym battle is. That that um, cave or mountain or whatever you want to call it, dungeon maybe. Even if you're or if you're one of those old school JRPG people, it was ah, uh, it was man. But it had some good items. It had the item to make Seedra into Kingdra. And then that's where you can get that one Pokemon. Tyogre, I believe his name is. And then it evolves into Hitmon New Hitmon Chan or Hitmon Top. Which you have to have a free slot in your party because for some reason they wanted to do that. You had to have a free slot that you can just transfer it to your freaking bank or something. Not bank, Pokemon. Uh, computer, Pokemon storage, whatever you want to call it. Should have just allowed you to transfer it. How's that? Oh, that missed too. Ow! Additional damage. Damn, dude, this is taking forever. Thank you. Probably gonna take each other out. Blame for the weak spot. That was just her first Pokemon, wasn't it? Yep. Of the next Pokemon. Oh, it's Houndour. Houndour. But it's Dower number one. one Pokemon oh, I didn't die. So, I guess let's weaken it with the Thunderbolt, I suppose. Alright, uh, let's go with Big Daddy. I want to save Mew for last. I like when you come a big papa. What not? That was a glancing blow. 
and Bite was reassigned, or whatever, in Generation 2 from Normal to Dark. That was an interesting switch, but I guess they had to add some Dark-type moves for the new Dark-type Pokémon. And, um... Then they had Faint Attack, but they had an F-A-I-N-T Faint. All up until, like, Generation 6 when they renamed it Faint F-E-I-N-T Attack. So that was pretty interesting. But even in the animation of Faint Attack in Generation 2, it, it actually looked like they fainted away. But I don't know. Um, and then they redid Gust from Normal to Flying, which is I thought was good. Especially for like Pidgey, if you want to get a Pidgey early on. And he has a flying move early on. It's a weak flying move, but it's a flying move nonetheless. Big hit. Not enough to take it out, but something. the end of this battle, right? There are no more remaining Pokemon. Murkrow. Murkrow didn't get an evolution for two more generations. Now this one is just Rocket Grunt. It's not Team Rocket Grunt. So a single person is a rocket, but the whole team is Team Rocket. I guess. I don't know. Alright, next is Earrings Lady. Executive. A lot of poison types. A dark type. I think I'm gonna start off with Mew. Then it has Radicate or the Katung. It might not be that great, but I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. And yeah, let's just go like that. Yeah, man, this battle is dragging on. This should have been the end. Just three, not four. Come on. Wish they had a fast forward button for this. And of course, you went with Eradicate. See how much damage I can do. Hope he doesn't have Super Fane, just automatically takes up half my HP. Well, it took off less than half. Come on. What will the other side do? Oh, thief! Stole my berry. Stole my berry. Barely survived. Super Fang. There. Freaking knew it. Half my HP gone. Oh, I'm going to take you out and then soft boil. Soft boil egg, probably. Get out of here. Right a set. Next up is... Arbok. Well, he might glare at me and paralyze me, so let's just try and take him out in one shot. Let's see if I can do it. Air Arbep? What kind of name is that? Arbep. Super effective? Oh, not a one shot kill though. I didn't try to glare me, he just sledge bombed me. And I was poisoned? Alright, I got a soft boil. How much HP do I got? Not enough. Not enough, man. What's that? The hit lands right off. Damn it. Both Pokemon show signs of fatigue. A psychic blast. Yes, it's a hit. Oh, it has no strength left. Alright, who's your last Pokemon executive? 
Lickitung. A two normal type Pokemon. Guess I just psychic him. I don't know, man. I don't know. A decent hit. Not too bad. Not that great. Poke Daddy. Oh, it's Snorlax. The number of remaining Pokemon is two to one. Another thief. Oh my! Item was stolen. Didn't thief actually work against like random? Well, not just random Pokemon, but like. Trainer's Pokemon in Generation 2. Like, you can actually steal an item against this computer trainer and then, like, keep it. But then I think they fixed that later on. I don't know. I, like, didn't really use Thief back in the day. Of course, it's useful now for, like, heart scales and stuff like that. Just Thief a bunch of heart scales and then use them for the move tutors. Alright, now we finally go to the last battle. The last executive? Is he called an executive too? Rocket executive? Or is it Rocket Headmaster or something? I don't know. Team Rocket Battle 4! Sorry to say it, but this is the end. I will eliminate you, Rocket Executive. Oh, he's got a Wub effect. That could be interesting. All right, let's go with. I don't know if I should use Mew because that looks like bad news from Mew. Probably do. Can you dig it? Let's start with Can you dig it. Big Mama? Should I use Big Mama? Wait a minute. Oh yeah. Special attack isn't that great though. In Generation 2. It's all special defense. Damn it. Maybe I shouldn't. I gotta use Big Daddy though. Race our Thunders. Big Mama. Let's just go with Big Mama. I'm just, I'm risking it. This is a battle against a Team Rocket executive. Let's hope the challenger can thwart Team Rocket and resume battles against the gym leader. All right. I know I'm ground type. He's flying type, but don't worry about that because I got Rock Slide. Combat and face each other. And he's switching out, isn't he? Okay, Freaking knew it. Failed Gambit. Wubba Fett. You just can use... Um, what is it called? Here's the first move. Counter. He has counter and... And mirror... Not mirror move. Mirror coat. Okay. I'm gonna try something. Something else. Because he knows what I'm gonna use with... Doug Trio and that other person, Snorlax, it shrouded itself with safeguards. can just keep using counter and be effective. Or I can just keep that? using light screen, or not light screen, I was looking at light screen because I'm going to choose it. You can just use Mirror Coat with Big Mama though, Chansey. It's better protected against special attacks. See? Mirror coat. Dang it. Well, hopefully this light screen will help repel it. What's this? Oh, that's a miss. Attack missed. What next? Oh my, missed again. A 
A hot battle is unfolding. What now? Oh, that missed too. Seriously, man, come on. This is gonna be an annoying ass, long ass battle, isn't it? Both Pokemon continue to miss. What's going to happen with this battle? Switching out, yep. He's like, F this, I'm getting tired. Hold that, let's see if I can actually hit my blizzard this time around. Still an in hit? Are you seriously? How is it possible to miss that many times? Should I just use thunder? Confused Ray. Wow. You want to make this battle even more annoying, right? So I can just confuse and hit myself like a billion times? Thank you. Jeez. Didn't even take off half of his HP, dude. Shit. Probably should have just used Psychic. Critical hit? You took off that much HP? I know her her defense is like nothing, but come on. Watch me switch to Doug Trio and then he switches back to what effect. I'm so tired of this. Pokémon appears with a cross. Sparks are flying from both competitors. The command if I use main. Sand Attack on Wubbuffet, will it move? I mean, will it miss its move? Because it's just counter moves. I don't know. Damn it. Confused Ray again? Oh my my. Shut up. Shut up, dude. Rock executive. Thank you. Took him out. Rubbed out. Interesting choice of words. And back to Wubbuffap. <laughs> uh, interesting name. After that interesting choice of words. Alright, I'm gonna try and see how Sand Attack goes. Oh, but if you put Safeguard up, will I still be able to Sand Attack? I don't... Or is it just against, like, the other status moves, like para Paralyze and stuff? I, like, never really use Safeguard. I've, I looked it up before, but I can't remember. Let's see. Yeah, I, no, I can still use it. So yeah, it's just against like paralysis, I think. I'm just gonna keep sand attacking him and then hope that it makes him miss my counter, but I'm not 100% sure if it will. Destiny Bond. I'm not taking you out just yet. It only works like if you use it right before I take you out, right? I wonder who created Wubba Fett. I mean, Destiny Bond, Safeguard, Counter, and Miracoda as its only moves. Let's see if Sand Attack does anything at all. Didn't seem to do anything there. What the crap? How did it one shot kill me? I took off like 70 HP? Oh yeah, I have 120. Okay, yeah, then yeah, I guess. So that was like 140. Jeez, man. Come on. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna win this one. Unless Sand Attack does work later on, but I don't think it is. 
because I sand attacked him four Pokemon. times. The safeguard wore off. The white hot battle continues. It shrouded itself Damn it. With safeguard. Then he might just freaking destiny bond me and I'm I'm gone. Yes, it's a hit. Damn it. This is this isn't good. See? It's time to take the opponent with it. How's that? That was a glancing blow. <sighs> I don't know if I should try and take him out, because if he destiny destiny bonds me right here, it's over. I'm just gonna amnesia it and hope he like runs out of destiny bond PP. Because that was the third Destiny Bond. I believe you only have 5 PP for Destiny Bond, don't you? And that's 4. I hope it's only 5, because if it's more than that, then I can be screwed. Maybe I should do it once more just to be safe. That's fine. Yep. Okay, I think I'm safe. I think I'm in the clear. Special defense. Special defense won't rise any higher, man. Alright, come on. Take him out, baby. Take him out. Oh, you're switching. You chicken shit. What's your last Pokemon? Oh, Ooh. Doom or Houndoom. His name's Doom App. Doom Map? Is it Doom App or Doom Map? But either way, I took a lot off of him with that body slam. Still Cold Earthquake. Super effective. Flamethrower. My special defense is super high. So you're not going to do much damage like that, unless you burn me. Then that also lowers my attack, but nope, you're fainted. I think I have this one in the bag, man. It was a long, long road, but I think I might have this rubbed out. Again with those choice of words, man. Alright, here we go, baby, here we go. Body slam for the win. It's over. And no Destiny Bond to take me. Everything's safe. Ah. Thank God, man. Battle end. Winner, Hector. Losers, and my signal's messing up. I hope, hope that I mess up with the game capture. I don't know. But I guess that's it. Um, this does not mean that you have dashed our grand designs. Yeah, Dad, shut up. Team Rocket clear. And then back to the Johto Gym Leader Castle. Alright, but I think that's it for this video. This is a very, very long one. Um, thumbs up if you liked it, I guess. And subscribe for more of Johto Gym Leader Castle. And more gameplay type stuff. Vlogs, gameplay commentary, reviews, strategy guides and stuff. Because more is going to be coming in the future.